Let's begin by breathing in deeply. Breathe in deeply from your diaphragm, filling your lungs completely with the cool, wonderful oxygen. And as you release your breath, you release all the tensions from your body. Again, breathe in through your nose, all the way into your lungs, filling your lungs completely. Hold for just a moment and then let go. Let everything go. Relax, comfortable and still. A final time, breathe in from your nose, filling your lungs completely. Hold for that wonderful moment and then release, relax, let go. Completely relax your body and mind, releasing any tensions and any thoughts. So we're going to begin relaxing the body, starting from our toes and moving our way up to our head. And as we do, we're going to open, clear, and charge your chakras. So let's start with your feet. Bring your attention to your feet. Be aware of them. And as you become aware of them, allow them to relax. Relax every little muscle within your feet. The soles of your feet are so very important and they contain your entire energy body of your chakra systems mapped in miniature on the soles of your feet. So as you begin to feel the soles of your feet, you might start to feel a little tingling or something interesting happening at the soles of your feet. Your feet are what connect you to Earth, and Earth, Mother Gaia, will gladly take any unwanted or stuck energy from your energy body, and she will recycle it into something beautiful and lovely that could be used by something else. So when you walk barefoot on nature, you feel better because nature is always willing to take your stuck energy and it's always giving you beautiful energy like fresh air that you breathe in. But let's move up from the feet and feel the wave of relaxation move from your toes to the heels of your feet up into your ankles and it travels that wave of relaxation into your calves relaxing the calf muscles and your shins now and feeling it move up and relax your knees and as you relax your entire body is getting heavier and relaxed and feel the wave of relaxation move up into your thighs feel your thigh muscles relax so beautifully and now your legs your entire body from your legs all the way down to your toes completely relaxed. Now bring your attention to the base of your spine. That is the location of your root chakra and it is an energy vortex. And if you happen to be sitting, then you are sitting on your base chakra right at the bottom of your tailbone and it opens downwards and as you bring your attention there it begins to open like a flower with all the petals opening one at a time and the energy begins to flow from the center of the flower out through the chakra and the energy that flows from this chakra is the energy of simple existence. Very, very basic energy. I am here. I exist. I'm alive. 
And if you'd like to continue the energy flow, affirm in your mind that you exist, you are here. It is safe for you to be here and it is safe for you to be here now. And as you can imagine from your base chakra, a root growing down, down into the earth. And as you root to Mother Earth, you become aware that you are a child of this world. You can feel that you are loved and you are wanted here. And as you do, your base chakra, your root chakra opens more and allows you to release all that is burdensome or heavy or painful, anything that's overworked or exhausting, all that energetically no longer serves you can be released down through your root chakra, through the taproot you created into Mother Gaia and sent to her in a loving way so she can reprocess it. Nothing you can send to Mother Earth is bad. She is able to receive the energy and transform it and reuse it somewhere else. You are giving her a gift, enriching life with the gift you give. And as you clear out all the unwanted stuck energy from your root chakra, your base chakra, you can now become aware that there is a red light that shines from the very center of your base chakra, lighting up all around you. And you can allow that beautiful red light to shine out strong and bright and beautiful. And now that your root chakra is shining bright, I invite you to bring your attention to your sacral chakra. Your sacral chakra is an energy center in your pelvic region. And as you bring your attention there, so it begins to open. Like a flower, slowly opening petal by petal. And you can allow it to open and feel the energy beginning to flow out from your sacral chakra. The energy of the sacral chakra is the energy of instinct. Anger, drive, desire it is the energy of motivations that come without rational thought or explanation. It's a very powerful and urgent energy. It is the part of you that makes decisions about everyday life and then acts on those decisions. Without this part of you, you could not be here in this reality, certainly not present on planet Earth. So send love to the sacral chakra, and as you do, you can become aware of a wonderful orange light shining out brightly and relaxing your body more and more, allowing the energy vortex of your sacral chakra to open up more and more. And as it shines, a wonderful orange light and clears out any stuck or blocked energy. It is bright and beautiful just from your loving attention. And now you can bring your attention to your solar plexus chakra. It sits just below your sternum in your solar plexus and it opens front and back and it is the center of the separate self. The center of the person you are imagining yourself to be in this incarnation. It is the place when you point to yourself called the ego. It is the self that de does not know that it is an immortal creator being creating its reality. And in this moment, I invite you to say energetically to this ego persona that you love it unconditionally and bring it nurturing and healing. Allow the beautiful yellow light of the solar plexus chakra to shine and allow yourself to love the personality that it represents. Breathe in beautiful, fresh air 
and release out through your base chakra any stuck energy that is in your solar plexus chakra area. You can aid the healing process of your ego who may have hurts or wounds by telling that that they are good. Your intentions are good. You try hard and when you get lost you always try to find your way back to your path. When you cause pain you try to fix it. When you are hurt you heal and you try to heal those around you. You are trying to make the world a better place. This is your nature and any hurts that have been created were just created to protect. Send your unconditional love to your ego persona, to your solar plexus, and feel the release of anything stuck or heavy. And as the stuck and heavy energy releases, the bright yellow light of the solar plexus shines out wonderfully allow it to shine out strong and bright and beautiful and now we can bring your attention to your heart chakra your heart chakra is the energy vortex in the center of your chest right about where your physical heart is located and it opens front and back and as you bring your attention to your heart chakra so it begins to open the energy flows through it and the energy that flows through the heart chakra is very beautiful indeed it is the energy of love compassion healing belonging and of emotions and as you continue to breathe in feel and become aware of your physical heart beating in your chest. Really feel your heart muscle sending all the healing, energizing, loving energy throughout your body. And as you send it love, perhaps you'll notice your heart rate gently slowing and allowing your body to relax in sympathy relaxing your arteries and veins allowing the healing energy to move according to your body's design and this is the place where our source energy comes from the heart chakra is where the unconditional love beyond any love your mind can comprehend beyond any love you've ever felt comes from the source through your heart chakra and when the chakra is wide open and the energy of source flows free and clear you can become aware of a deep emerald green light that shines out from the very center of your heart chakra lighting up all around you and allow the beautiful emerald light to shine brightly and just by letting this beautiful emerald light shine from your heart chakra you bring subtle beautiful heart filled changes to the world and now I'd like you to become aware of your throat chakra this is the energy vortex that opens forward where your vocal cords are and as you bring your attentions to the area of your throat it begins to open the chakra opens and the energy begins to flow and this is the energy of self-expression it's not just expression through your mouth and what you speak but also how you express yourself through your hands and what you do your throat chakra is the center of your expression. Every word you speak, every word you write or type, everything you touch or anything you do in life. Every time you dance 
or sing or play or shake somebody's hand. Whatever's happening in the world, it's your throat chakra opening up and expressing. And so if you make the choice to have your expressions always in alignment with your heart source energy, then what you put out in the world is reflective of your own soul. And when your heart chakra is opened and unblocked and shining its light, then you are acting in alignment with your heart and your higher soul. And you are speaking your deep truths and doing what is right for you. So allow the energy to flow free and clear through your heart chakra, clearing away any stuck or heavy energy, clearing it out down through past your heart chakra, your sacral chakra, down past your root chakra, through it to out your body. And so your expressions, all of who you are and what you express, when your throat chakra is completely open, every moment that it is open and connected to your heart chakra, you are channeling your divine self into the world so that the words you speak and the things you do are all in alignment with your divine self. So you can become aware that your throat chakra shines out a beautiful sky blue light shining from your throat and as it shines it lights up all the world around you in a beautiful light blue and you can allow the light to shine out strong and bright and beautiful now that our throat chakra is beautiful and shining bright we move up now to the third eye chakra this is the energy vortex at the center of your brow, just above and between your eyes. So bring your attention there, and as you bring your attention, it begins to open. It opens, and the energy begins to flow through it. This is the energy of insight and receptive knowingness. This is the energy vortex where you receive intuition and guidance that you need from the universe. You receive visions and dreams and extrasensory perception. Your eyes tell you about the world in front of you, but your third eye tells you what's really going on behind the illusions of the reality you live in. This is your receptive chakra. And as you raise the frequency of your vibration, it also becomes the center point from which you can create your reality. It is also known as the magical chakra. And if you take a moment to affirm that you are being guided and you are protected and that you know everything you need to know when you need to know it, then your third eye chakra shines brighter and opens wider. But it's not just about seeing, it's about deepest knowing and deepest insight. So we clear any blocked or stuck energy from our third eye chakra, allowing the energy to shine bright as it opens wide and the energy flows free and clear. And as it does, you can become aware of a purple light that shines from the center of your third eye chakra and it lights up all around you and you can allow the light to shine out strong and bright. And now finally, you can bring your attention to your crown chakra. Right at the very top of your head is an energy vortex and it sits at your top of your head and it opens like a spiral funneling energy into your head, down into your third eye chakra. It receives the cosmic energy, the sacred energy from the galaxy and the universe. And it receives the energy into your crown chakra and it makes your, the energy available to the rest of your energy body. And it energizes and provides healing 
and protection and cleansing. And as you bring the energy into your energy body, it also carries out the old, the block and stuck. It carries it along through your energy body all the way out through your root chakra, sending the stuck energy to Gaia, where she will do what she needs to do to turn it into a useful energy for something else. And as you become aware, you can also be aware that the chakra is fully open and bright and lit because this chakra is the culmination of all the other chakras. And since all your other chakras are open and light and shining bright, all you need to do is just observe the crown chakra shining the pure bright white light powerful and bright and your now your body is in a perfect state of relaxation each chakra is lit and shining and bright sending its energy out into the world clearing the powerful beautiful energy just be aware from the base chakra all the way to the crown chakra, your chakras are clean and clear and shining bright. Feel a pathway running between the energy fields of each of the chakras. And now we are going to use that energy field. Imagine it like a tube. We're going to use it to connect your heart chakra to all the other chakras energetically and then we are going to bring them together and if you would like you can use your hand to aid in this your hand can be a reminder to pull the energy in so return your thoughts and your awareness back to your heart chakra Feel it open, bright and wide, pulling in from the back source energy and channeling it through into your energy body and then out through the front of you. Feel the love and strength that it brings. And now imagine connecting it down through the tube to your sacral chakra, your solar plexus chakra and your root chakra. Feel the heart chakra pulling the energy and now pull those chakras into your heart chakra. Feeling them all now as part of one chakra. And now send the energy of your heart chakra all the way back up through the tube, up through your throat chakra, up through your third eye chakra into your crown chakra. And now imagine your heart chakra pulling those chakras into your heart chakra space. And now all your chakras are connected by your heart chakra and they become one beautiful integrated chakra. You are complete. You are the totality of everything in your energy body and you allow the beautiful bright light to shine out in the universe, a beautiful expression of your complete energy body. So now, as you really feel this connected, single unified chakra, feel it shining bright out, Allow the space inside your chest that is this combined chakra, allow it to expand more and more. Expand outside your chest, expand past even your arms when they're outstretched. Expand to cover your whole body, completely encompassing you. If you're lying down, it stretches past your legs and arms. Stretch it out as far as you like. And this unified chakra energy 
is your protection. It's always around you, radiating from the center of your being, protecting you. It's a shell, and no darkness can come into this shell of beautiful, pure source energy that gets its power from your united chakras. And every time you do this meditation, you can strengthen this beautiful ball of energy created by your unified chakra, and it protects you more and more. And I invite you to just sit for a little while, feeling the wonderful feeling of your clear and clean chakras shining their combined light out into the world. It's amazing to feel yourself unified, your entire energy body in harmony together. And just sit for a moment and feel how you're supposed to feel, whatever you're meant to feel. Sit for a while and feel it. Let your heart and your soul show you what you need to be shown. Just enjoy being in this wonderful, vibrant frequency. And I will leave you now. And you can, if you choose, stay with this feeling for as long as you like. And when you are ready to become back to regular consciousness, you can take some breathing, nice deep breaths and wiggle your toes and come back and continue your day. And if you prefer, and it's appropriate, when you are done being this beautiful energy of your united chakra, you can then just drift off to sleep. It's up to you. It's now your time. Enjoy. Enjoy.